fam, it's your girl Gladys, aka Is That Your Hair, and welcome back to my channel. I'm here with an oldie but a goodie. This unit here was super popular, like extremely popular back in, I believe, 2016, so about three years ago. At the time, I just felt like, ugh. I feel like that's just a little bit too much hair for me, my personal taste, so I just never bought her. However, I got curious about her again after I saw my girl, Brittany, aka the Hearts and Cake 90. She was wearing Misha on her Instagram story, and I was like, bitch, you look, blah, blah, good. So I was like, you know what? I want this unit. So Ashley was kind enough to send me this unit and I have Nisha. And I have Nisha in the number two color. Nisha is a lace front unit. She comes with L parting here, two combs in the front, a comb in the back with adjustable straps. Let me give you a quick 360 of the unit. So let's get into the pros of this unit. The first pro would have to be this gorgeous, natural hair texture. Y'all, this is absolutely beautiful. It's so soft. It literally feels like my hair, if it was super long, <laughs> it feels like my hair was blown out and curled um, under a dryer. And after you take the curls out, you know, they fall like this. This is, this is, Gorgeous hair. Now, I've been really into showcasing natural hair textures lately. I did do a lookbook that you may have seen from the Janet Collection featuring four of their units. And I, I loved Amani and Jenna the most out of those units because of the, the curls and the style and just the texture. However, I do have to make note of something. My main issue with those units from the Janet Collection was the fact that they say that they're heat safe, but they're not. When I tried to, you know, flatten down my Joe with the curly one, the girl started smoking a little bit. I was like, whoa, no, <laughs> my Joe was about to burn up. Y'all know how much I love the Joe unit. Same thing with Amani. When I tried to flatten her down, you know, I saw the burning happening. It just was not a good situation. I don't know why they advertised it was heat safe. Clearly it's not. You could use a blow dryer to flatten on the top of those units, but, if I have a unit that says heat safe, I should be able to put my curling wand on top of it with no problem. So I noticed with Nisha, she's definitely heat safe. Flattened on the top, no problem. This unit came out in 2016, y'all. This texture, this quality, synthetic, is everything. I don't know what fibers Outre was using back then, but I'm like, yo, y'all should have passed it down to Janet too. Y'all should have got the memo. This is a type of fibers that need to be used on natural hair units that are synthetic, like this right here. This is soft, bouncy, beautiful. Oh my gosh, this is this is everything. I'm just doing a little bit of comparison because my Jode unit by the Janet Collection did feel a little bit on the rough, coarse side. It felt like my hair when it's not moisturized. But this right here, ooh, this has all of the moisture. I just can't believe this came out back in 2016. I remember how units were back then and the fact that it, you know, comes with this really nice parting space. All I had to do was just add powder to it. This is just a, this is just a, a high quality synthetic wig, point blank period. I really wish that synthetic wigs that are coming out with the natural textures now, three years later, need to take notes from Outre and what they were doing three years ago. You feel me? I'm just, I'm just floored by this. I feel like I'm gonna spend my whole video talking about the texture, but it's just that bomb. And I'm running my fingers through with very little snagging, very little issues. This is amazing. As far as cons to this unit, I mean, main con would probably be for me, this is just a personal con. It doesn't apply to everyone. This density is super full. This is all the hair to the front, y'all. This is a lot of hair. This is the reason why I didn't purchase it to begin with because I just felt like it would be a lot of hair for me and I probably wouldn't go out with her regularly with it. But it's so beautiful, oh my God. Some people might like it, some people won't. I don't care for the thick density. I really want it to be thinner. So I have some shears here and I kinda wanna see if I can thin her out just a little bit or maybe a lot, I don't know. So if y'all wanna see me do that, keep watching. Won't you pick me up at the park right now up the block while everyone sleeps I'll be waiting there with my tools, my nose, my hat, so I'm low-key If you tell the world, that will be weak Oh boy, see I'm trusting you with my heart, my soul I probably shouldn't let you, but if I, if I let this go Alright, 
fam, so I am back with Nisha after thinning her out. Look at all the hair I cut out of Nisha. Oh my God! <laughs> she just gets better and better. I'm floored that this is a synthetic wig. This is feeling like a kinky straight human hair unit. Straight up for $25. Oh my God. So let's just do a side by side comparison, right? This is all the hair to the front. So, this is all the hair to the front now. I didn't want to thin her out too much for, you know, people who still want the fullness. She's still full, just without the super thick density. That density was looking more like a 200% when I first got her. Now I think I got her down to like maybe like a 160%. She's still full, she looks full, but the density is definitely less. Like this is all the hair here. This is my kind of density. I actually like a density as low as 130%, honestly, but that's just me. I can deal with this too. Like this is gorgeous, y'all. Wow. Wow. Unbelievable. I cannot believe this came out three years ago. I can't believe this cost $25. Go pick Nisha up. Go pick her up. If you want some Thanksgiving living room hair, go get this unit. Yes, come through out tray. I'm here for this natural texture, for this body, this bounce. Look how soft this is, this parting space. Yo, you cannot go wrong with Nisha. Like this is gorgeous. Brittany, shout out to you for wearing her in your stories because that definitely encouraged me to, you know, seek out this unit. And I'm really glad I did. I'm about to wear this joint right now. I'm actually trying to hurry up and finish so I can go to brunch right now. And this is about to be my brunch hair. <laughs> Look at her. Right now she falls down on my chest, like a good 22 inches probably. Ooh, come on with the natural slay. I'm here for it. Are y'all here for it? Please drop a comment down below and let me know how you feel about this oldie but goodie. I just can't stop looking at myself. Like, oh, okay, okay. Please let me know what you think. How do you feel about Nisha? Did you purchase Nisha back in the day when she first came out? Or maybe you wore her more recently within the past year or so. What do you think of her? How do you feel about the density? Do you prefer a lighter density like I do? Or do you prefer like the fullness that Nisha is so known for? I really like her like this and I definitely feel comfortable wearing her out now. Let me know if me showing you how to thin her out was helpful. As far as just some tips when it comes to thinning out, make sure you're not like taking this and just cutting it like it's a pair of scissors. You're supposed to just lightly go like this very lightly and then brush it out. As far as the reason why I, you know, thinned out certain places, I just knew I wanted to take away the fullness in the middle a little bit and a little bit from the top, but that was just my personal preference. It's up to you how you would do it if you thin her out. So yeah, let me know if you have a wig that you want to thin out too. I feel like with this hair, I'm about to have like four Thanksgiving plates. I feel like with this hair, <laughs> This unit is absolutely gorgeous and Altre definitely knew what they were doing when they came out with this unit. I see why she was so popular on the YT. And yeah, I just wanted to bring her back for y'all. So let me know what you think. Also, if you want to be updated on some of the wigs that I'm coming out with, make sure you follow me on Instagram at is that your hair. It's the same name with the three R's at the end. I'm on there every day. I'm on stories. I post on my feed. So come follow me so we can be Instagram friends. If you want to see some of my other natural hair units, Make sure you check them out over here to the right of me. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.